Well, this package arrived about four days ago. Um, I just spontaneously bought it. It was uh, something um, when I just looking up cards for my videos and stuff like that. Let's get started. Uh, these are kind of weird. I don't know where these, what these originated from. Uh, I'll show you. It's from um, an anime called Card Captor Sakura. Um, what's cool about these? Um, they come in parts, apparently. Each one is numbered differently. And on the bag, you have this uh, cool little like thank you sticker thing. I'm gonna take it off and keep it. All right. As you can see, you have I think part one, part two, um, three. Four and five. Um, I'm going to be opening part one. Um, uh, just to see what we're dealing with. Uh, this is a weird novelty I do not know how to deal with. It was super cheap, and um, I liked it, or at least what it looked like. These look like holographic cards, too, so we'll see. Maybe I'll have to make a binder. <laughs> um, wow, these are definitely interesting. All right, um, let's see here. You got these little stuff on here. Um, I'm not going to use Google Translate on this. I'm just trying to do a video. Whatever. It's part one. So I wonder if these are all part about the show. Well, only one way to find out, right? Okay. Um, that's what we have. We have a piece of paper. Is this like a printable manga? And it's in the original writing. It is. Cool. I guess each one that kind of explains everything here. And, uh, I'll have to Google Translate this whole thing and then kind of put up a picture of my next one or something. I don't know. I like this. I think it's recapping the whole entire story, maybe. I don't know. All right. That's super cool. I like how the fact it's in, um, not English. Eh, you don't hear me say that much. Just don't uh, credit that, or just don't uh, scrutinize me too much when it comes to my gameplay for uh, Crystal Chronicles. I thought I had the option for Japanese voices, but still everything in English not, is not the way it went. <clears throat> All right. Well, there's... Uh... Oh, I think this is a battle card system. Something 400 and then 3 or 430. Um, oh, that's cool. That's the back of the card. Um, yeah. Each one of these cards has, I think, an attack in defense or attack in magic rating. This is your holographic one. It's like one of the costumes our friend made for her, I guess. Um, she was doing a lot during the show. Um, there's another one. Apparently, he was also the main protagonist during the entire show. Oh, I'm sorry. Spoilers alert for a 20-plus-year-old show. Um, okay. Okay. Same thing with that card. Um, do really doesn't describe how this works. This is kind of cool. Um, somewhere original outfit? Nope. 
yeah, apparently her friend was came from a rich family that designed clothing, so her friend basically was experimenting with her by making all these clothing that she wore in the battle. Okay. These are kind of cool looking. Is that, wow, 600. Is that the strongest that for Sakura so far? No, she has an 800. Or 800 and 850. Um, I'm trying to remember when she wore every last one of these outfits. I have seen every episode thanks to streaming services. Oh, the cat maid outfit. Um, I can't remember episode where these all came from. Hmm. All right. Um, that's kind of cool. Um, all right. Well, so far the cards don't seem too dangerous for me to show on um, a YouTube video. Uh, this was an eBay listing. Um, I do not have it per currently be able to bring it up. Maybe in the next one. Or when I get done. I don't know. Okay, I've seen that episode, obviously. Uh, was she oh, she was one of the crow. Uh, when um, Crow gets reincarnated or whatever. That was uh, one of the... Uh, Monsters or whatever that he brought back. Yeah, there's Crow right there. Um, that's kind of cool. Uh, that was the other one that came back too. He's like a, he's kind of like a cat boy or whatever. Um, okay, these are kind of cool. Um, Okay. Well, these are kind of cool. I don't know what these two symbols mean. I'll have to do a Google uh, image translator next time before I do one more of these to figure out ahead of time. So I'm just looking at them. Um, this is cool. It was worth it. I don't know how much I paid. I'll have to go check my uh, eBay uh, purchase thing. I know it was pretty cheap. Um, I'd say it's pretty cool so far. I'm pretty sure there's some type of rules on these. Um, I don't know what it is, but it's cool. Um, what does number two look like? Oh, the backs are different too. Well, the kind of got smashed during transit, but I really don't care too much about that. Okay, cool. Anyways, um, I hope you like this. I kind of got it for all of you to watch. Um, I did like Card Captor Sakura. I was trying to find the tarot cards, um, but they're too expensive at the moment, so I didn't get them. Anyways, this is kind of pretty cool. I think I will um, try this every other week or once, one, one every Saturday. Uh, what is that? One, two, three, four more. Um, so that's about a month worth of content, uh, at least weekend wise. Anyways, I'll get off over the 10 minute mark. Um, this was actually pretty cool. Um, that will ever stay up there. Okay. Um, I actually kind of like this. Um, let me go put these away for now. So I don't accidentally. Uh, whatever. I'm going to go ahead and put this on my shelf with the other uh, video content that I plan on doing later. And I think I will actually pop the sticker off the packaging. Cool. Anyways, I hope you have a great day. And uh, if you like this, could you uh, please leave a like? Uh, maybe leave a comment about what cards or how you think about this. And, uh, if you really like this content, um, you can subscribe. I have plenty of bizarre stuff coming up and I have a bunch of extra figures and stuff coming in. 
So goodbye, and I hope everyone has a great day, and goodbye.